All right, so we are back, and we're going to go with the uh, scientist's option this time. Um, I think I convinced the soldiers, so they should join me. <coughs> yes? They should join me. I think your plan is more sound. <sighs> I'm relieved you've decided to make the smart and logical choice. However, I don't think this decision will go over well with the good captain. Hey! The hell are you and Frankenstein jabbering about over here? Now, now, captain. We're just coming to a decision. You thought I'd just give in to your idea? Tur Clay! Wolf! On me! Yes, sir. Ugh, fine! I don't need your help! Oh, dear. Oh. Alright, I did not convince Clay. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh dear. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Sergeant Clay. Your brave warrior. Harry Kilgore. Never, never mind. I. <laughs> Yo, f off, bro. What? I'm, I'm good. All right. Don't take too long coming to a decision. I, I already. <clears throat> Can I help you? Uh, you're welcome. How are you feeling about how things went down? I'm glad you decided not to give in to Kilgore's bloodlust. Our experiment must be completed. Yes, we have bloodlust in other places. So, you're Dr. Kime's assistant? No, no, we're equals. Our abilities complement each other. Like fire and ice. How big was the science team here? Nearly two dozen. We lost quite a few when the cryo lab went down. The rest, when the subjects broke containment. Talk to you later. Farewell. Doctor? <clears throat> I assume you need something? Uh, yeah, you're welcome. How are you feeling about how things went down? Well, I'm certainly pleased you went with my plan. Kilgore was ready to kill me. <laughs> if not for you, I'd most certainly be dead. Kilgore ain't gonna kill more. Tell me about your... I think we asked him last time about the experiments. As I had previously stated, I was one of the head researchers on the Enclave's efforts to control death claws. The end result of that was the pacification devices, which were effectively headsets that were placed on the death claws. The goal of this experiment was to continue the research and get rid of those clumsy headsets, and just play the noise directly to the creatures. Alright, what are we doing now? The plan? Oh, yes, the plan. Well, we simply need to finish the experiment. So, should I just sit around and wait, or...? Oh, no, 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 no. Sitting around would be a waste of our time. And your talents, I suppose. There is lab equipment that is critical to finishing the experiment, and we need your help to retrieve it. All right, what can I do? Oh, good, good. Thank you for being so helpful. Now we need you to retrieve some lab equipment that is critical to the experiment's success. Uh, where? Well, the lab equipment we need would, of course, be in the labs, where we conducted the experiments. I don't know where else you would think to find them. I'm gonna kill you all over again. You want me to go in there? Well, you've shown you can handle yourself after taking care of the captain. Alright. I'll go see if I can find some. There should be everything you need inside the labs. Some of it. Hi. What is it? How do you feel? Kilgore might have been bloodthirsty, but you should still be careful with the scientists. They're the ones that got us into this mess, remember? Oh no, I came down the elevator. You got in this mess. Tell me about yourself. Well, I've been with the science team longer than the Gunners. I was part of their group when we set this place up. They do their experiments and I make sure the lights stay on. Pretty simple arrangement. Bye. Alright, see ya. Sorry about, uh, Sergeant. Hey there. Sup? 
Uh, how you feeling? Well, I'm still alive, so that's an upside. Alright, did we ask about yourself? I used to run with the caravan. Yep. Alright, see you, man. Yep. <laughs> yep. Find a way into the cryolabs. Alright, so... I'm imagining this is going to be about the same here and there. Hopefully the doctor doesn't betray us at the end. Yeah, yeah. Wow, okay, maybe not. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Dick shots forever. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, you are indeed strong. Hey, just follow me. They are tough. Only opens with a key. Head deeper. Did I not? I thought I got the key. Oh, now I got the key. All right, we're gonna break through this time. You shatter the ice with your big, strong, meaty hands. Ba bam. Call me the icebreaker. <laughs> Grab the lab supplies. Whoa. Nope, but okay. Um. No. Oh, lab supplies. Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? Oh, yeah. Um. Dr. Kaim? Hi, Dr. Kaim. Hello, friend. Good to know this system is working again. Judith fixed up the intercom. We should have a solid connection to talk down there. The intercom was broken? Oh, yes, it was quite broken. Never fear, though. Judith was our audio equipment specialist, and she was able to repair it excellently. All right. Uh, what do you need? Yes, yes. You're very good at realizing I want things. We need you to capture a test subject. Mm -hmm. Capture? What do you mean, test subject? One of the experiments, the mutants, the monsters in the basement, the Frankensteinian creations, as the good captain would have put it. Oh, okay. Uh, sounds above my pay grade. No, no, it's very simple. All you need to do is lure one of them into a place where we can capture them. All right, sure. Thank you. All I need is for you to lure one of the subjects into an airlock. Should be quite simple, really. Lure the experiment out. Broken. <clears throat> uh... Is this it? Got it! <laughs> Good work! Now come bring the lab equipment up so we can work on finishing this experiment. Alright, so that was loose in the boards is what we did. Got it. Here's the lab equipment. Ah, yes, yes. Bring it here. Allow me to quickly inspect it. Hmm, everything seems to be accounted for. Some minor damage, but still functional. Thank you again. Now we can return to our experiment. Is this gonna take long? Oh, no, no, not at all. We just need to double-check our research and make sure it works. Anything I can do to help? No, you can't help with the experiment. But I do believe Mr. McCaffrey may need some help. Uh, <clears throat> can I help you? Nope. <clears throat> what is it? You needed something? Yeah, I figure you're gonna have to drag me down to the mainframe to get the security lockdown reset. I don't know if I'm too happy about that arrangement. 
All right, I think there was another option. Maybe I can help you. Who said I needed your help? I know this bunker system's like the back of my hand. If anyone's your go-to guy, it's me. All right, maybe I can help you? Well, what would help is if I was better trained to defend myself. Oh, damn. All right, awesome. Using a melee weapon, remember to put your entire body into the swing. When using an automatic, use short controlled bursts. When reloading, make sure you shake your gun around a bunch to look cool. When aiming with iron sights, you want your sights to be lined up and have them bifurcate, bifurcate your target. That's good to know. I'll do a ball. Make it look cool. How does looking cool help? Don't worry. Uh, controlled bursts. Got it. Short control bursts. And, uh, put your whole body in the swing. That way more momentum and force is impacted. Smart. Now you're a genius. I think I got the gist. <laughs> she does not seem impressed. Doc, what, what? I'm sorry I didn't finish my, uh... Farewell. My dialogue with you. Hey there. Oh, hello there. All right, have you finished? Yes! Can't you hear that? No. No. No? I ain't heard. Jameson. Of course not! That's <laughs> the sound of progress. What? The sound of progress? Our experiment uses inaudible tones to pacify the creatures. Dr. Kaim is trying to be funny. Oh, so we're ready to go? You should be okay now that the experiments are pacified. I'm going to stay back here with Dr. Kaim. Anything I need to know? Just don't attack the experiments. They may regain their aggression. Oh, nice. How does the pacification work? We're piping in audible tones through the PA system that pacifies the experiments. All right, I'll head down. Good luck. Yes, good luck. Hey, there we go. Oh, nice. All right, cool. We got backup. All right, do not attack anyone. Hey. I think you don't even have a gun, dude. Why did I teach you my expertise? You don't got no gun. Don't touch them, don't, don't look at them. Don't breathe in their general direction. Oh, I really don't want to touch any of them. Jury rig. Give me a moment, I'll get the lockdown lifted. Thank God they got those terrifying creatures pacified. <laughs> this would be a lot more difficult if I was being eaten by mutants. That should do it. The lockdown is lifted. Nice work. Yep, we'll be up in a minute and we can leave. I don't think you'll be leaving. Have fun with my pets now. Really? God, Jameson. doctor. Jameson. That doesn't sound good. I think she was just cursing. Uh. Ah. Time to use that training. There we go. Definitely tougher this way. Oh. Oh, you fucking idiot. <laughs> Ha 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 
Jameson. Damn it, dude. It was an accident, you stupid bastard. Oh my god. Alright, Colin, don't die. Private Wolf, you're a fucking idiot. Oh, so am I. Yeah, I keep listening to your music, nerd. Oh my god! Oh, that was awesome. Jesus. Stay back, Colin. You're on fire. I can't let you die. Stupid bastard stuck. Oh god. Alright. Uh. Where did he go? Where'd Clint go? Oh my god. C Colin, sorry. My name's Colin, <laughs> damn it. Alright, will we be saved by the doctor this time? You survived? How? Carefully. Why'd you betray us? You were just going to get in the way of our experiments. Besides, more test subjects is always useful to have. Those meetings aren't that tough. They probably softened you up. Huh, well, no matter. I'll just take care of you myself. I'm sorry, Judith. And I'm sorry to you, too. I didn't know that she had become so consumed by her work that she would attempt something like this. How did she control the experiments? Using the high frequency and audible tones you helped us perfect. I feel terrible that something you helped us make was used against you. Why don't you stop her sooner? I apologize. My gun was still under construction. I feel terrible, but at least I made it in time and you survived. Guess it's time for us to go. Yes, yes. Why don't you check the elevator? Hey, should we nuke the place? Holy Jameson. Dude. My god. What? <laughs> <laughs> it's an ice gun. What? Oh, a dear, more experiments are coming. We'll have to hold them off till the elevator arrives. Yes, doctor. Colin. Hey, there you go. You got rid of your gun, dude. Take your gun out. Definitely got some intense recoil on this. Oh god. My goodness. Cheese it. Let's go, boys. Get in the Famous. damn elevator, you Famous. fucking idiot. Go. Excuse me. I assume you need something. I need you to get in the Famous. elevator, dude. There we go. Just had to smash him in the face. <laughs> Alright. We're safe. Kind of. Hey there. I thank you for getting me out of there alive. I'm unsure what I'll do now, but I want you to have this. Oh nice. Game of the gun. And I'm guess these are all the same. What are you gonna do now? I sincerely doubt there's many job openings on the surface for scientists with a background in cryo and audio engineering. But I'm gonna drop my new sick beats. Indeed. Farewell, and safe travels.
You too, Colin. Excuse me. You did good work down there. Appreciate you managing to get us out of their life. Appreciate you doing some shooting. God bless your souls. Time to take this house for myself. Corn. Alright, awesome. So now I can... I can live down here. It's really nice uh, interiors. Sweet. Awesome. Alright, so let's do the uh, one where we just completely decimate the scientists. Uh, <clears throat> I don't think it'll be that different. We just won't get a... They won't stick us up at the end. Your plan's the way to go. I'm glad you came to your senses and made the right choice. Let's put them in the ground. Frankenstein! <laughs> oh, yes. Uh, can I help? Give the devil my regards. What do you mean? Why did you do that? <laughs> Shut that mouth of yours before I blow it off your face. Wait. Wolf! Go lock up this cycle while we discuss the game plan. Wait, we're not gonna yes, shoot. You're not gonna shoot her? Oh, famous in. Oh, and he didn't finish his. He only has cord and a laser pistol. Hi. This better be good. You know your dudes. He doesn't know how doors work, right? Take all that you can carry. All right. So I guess she has to survive. So the. Oh wait, doesn't the. This thing working? Doesn't the Clank. dude. I guess she fixes the intercom. We secured the armory and the ammo. Good to hear. That doctor yeah. lady fixed up the intercom system so I can communicate down here. Our radio's on the fritz? No. With all the stone and steel, the signal ain't getting to you. Unless we use hardwired connections like the intercoms. You survived? How? There's like four giant dudes and we got a bajillion guns. What are you talking about? It's not that easy to kill me. Hmm, yes, well, we'll see about that. Huh, well, no matter. I'll just take care of you myself. I knew I should have put you <laughs> in the ground with Frankenstein. Bad call, boss. Don't sass me, Wolf. Go check on the elevator. Yes, boss. You planted the explosives, right? Mm-hmm. Good. Provided you weren't an idiot. That timer should be long enough for us to get the hell out of Dodge. Wolf, elevator, Jeez. status. It's on its way. Give it a minute. We don't have a minute. More mutants are on the way. Well, Jameson. Ain't got nowhere to run. All right, everyone dig in. We have to hold our ground here. Get out of the way. Look, I know you want to be a hero. Play. I locked the door. You know, the thing you should have all done before. Okay, now I unlocked it. My God. <laughs> hey, it's daytime this time. Ahem. <sighs> Never thought I'd see the surface again, to be honest. <laughs> but hell, we got out of there alive. And all thanks to your help. <laughs> Damn fine work in there. Here, I want you to have this as thanks. Oh, thanks. Guess this is goodbye. Safe travels, friend. When I get back to HQ, I'll be sure to shoot your name up the chain of command. Hopefully they take this report seriously, and all the others might think twice before gunning for your head. <laughs> <laughs> all right, everyone, I do believe that's gonna do it for CSET Presents The Experiment by Commonwealth Story Expansion Project. It was pretty awesome. Uh, really enjoyed all the interiors. Uh, the ice theme was pretty dang cool. Had those custom enemies, all the RPG elements, and uh, having those different endings was uh, very nice. I always enjoy that. Also, voice acting, as always, 
fantastic in all of uh, the CSET mods. Got some beautiful voice actors. I know some of y'all comment on the videos, so thank you so much for uh, voicing in Pignus's mods. Y'all do a fantastic, fantastic job. Thanks for watching, everyone. Hope you enjoyed, and we shall see you in the underground explosion future. Oh, yeah! Away! Patrons, patrons. Ooh. Patrons, patrons. Lining up, sitting down. Cartwheel. Patrons, patrons. Look at my spaghetti legs. Patrons, patrons. Ooh, I love every single one of you. Come inside of my living room. Take a seat in my comfy chair. I'm gonna do my spaghetti dance for your patron hair. Patron, patron, patrons. Here comes the second course. Better watch out. Ooh, it's some chocolate horse. Patrons, patrons. Check them out. Look them up. Patrons, patrons. Ooh, thank you very much to every single one of you. Patrons, patrons. Ooh, gonna give you a chest breach kiss. Mmm. Thanks for subbing, everyone. Much appreciated. Kiss, kisses, kisses. Have a wonderful Easter if you celebrate. And if not, have a beautiful, beautiful Sunday. Oh, yeah. Away again. Oh.